Hi Year 11, welcome to a little introduction about how to apply for SWB6 this year. We've changed the process slightly to make it friendlier, easier for you. It's all online and it's definitely COVID friendly. Every application will receive an interview with me as head of sixth form. Once I've received your application, I will email you with a date, a time and a location for your interview. I will also include your teacher, whose lesson you will be missing a little part of, into that uh, email so that they will know that you're missing from the lesson. I will meet you there, we'll have our interview and then I will escort you back to your lesson. If you are an external student, I will contact you as soon as I've received your application and we will um, work out together a suitable time for that interview to take place. So, where can you find the online application process? So, on our Ormiston swbacademy.org.uk website, you need to go to the drop down of SWB6. You will see on the About SWB6 some information and also the uh, Meet the SWB6 team and some general information in there. The next little bit, the courses, you will see here the um, downloadable course guide with the blocks on. A little bit of information about the blocks. You need to choose three subjects out of the four blocks. So you would need to choose a subject from uh, column A, B, C or D. Now those, those courses are not set in stone yet. So if there are two courses you want to say in column D, please put that information onto your application form because there might be lots of other students who want that and we might need to make changes. This is why the earlier you apply, the easier it is for us to be able to sort the courses. You also need to choose from the EPQ or the LIBF and there's more information about that in a moment. When you download that course guide, there, is, there are in there all of the requirements for each of the courses. You may not be, at the moment, meeting the requirements, particularly if you apply early on. Not to worry, put everything down on your application that you are completing, and when we have our interview, that's what we talk through. So don't worry at the moment, that's what we will go through in more detail when we have our interview. The next drop down in the SWB6 bit is Six Form Admissions and this is where you will find the Apply Online Here button. That is the form and the survey that you need to complete to get your interview with me. So you click the button and you go through the process and it automatically saves and sends it to me. So if you're not sure on something, it will save it in your Microsoft Forms area and you can come back to it and then when you're ready, you hit send and it comes through to me. Um, there's also a page for Six Form News if you're interested, particularly if you are an external student, have a look at the news and you'll see what we're up to, what we're about, it will give you a flavour of us. Don't forget to like us on Facebook too and you will see all of the um, posts about everything that we're doing. And the last little bit really to note, there is a, a frequently asked questions guide on there as well, you can have a look at that. The last little bit is the SWB6 transition, which is where uh, some members of staff have filmed, have recorded information about their courses, and that's really where, if you're not sure about something, you can have a look at the videos on there and see um, about what the courses are. There is also the last video on there about the EPQ and the LIB, that's what I spoke about earlier on. That's an extra enrichment we offer. More points for you if you're applying for university or apprenticeship you need to decide whether you are an EPQ or a LIBF student just for year 12. Uh, you get that qualification at the end of year 12. So the form does ask you to, to pop on whether you are an EPQ or a LIBF person there. Any other queries, as I've said, please do just email me and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Following your interview, you will all receive either a results day or a conditional offer. This means that you know exactly what grades you need. You can be really super organised, know that your place is safe with us or what grades you need to work towards and then you can relax and concentrate on your Year 11 studies. Following your interview, 
we like to keep in touch with you throughout Year 11 so that we know how we can best support you, we can offer any advice that we need to. So following your interview, if you have any queries, please email me and then I can either return your email, give you a phone call or arrange another meeting and come up to Sanderson if you're one of our students or we can arrange another meeting if you are an external student. You are on our books, you're one of our students, our future students and we're definitely here to help so you only need to ask. Goodbye Year 11, hope to speak to you soon.